Hi, this is Steve with part 12 of the BMW E36 rally car build. Well, there's my battery cable. That's the part that's going to come through the firewall, which originally did come through the firewall in the standard setup, but it's going to be on the passenger side of the car and not the driver's side. This is the kill switch location which we fitted up the other day. It's got the cable going across the starter motor and the feed from the starter motor back up into the main body um, supply. So I'll pull it off again and we'll just get this fitted onto the other tab. Okay, so that's the, the electronic kill switch I'm going to use. That's the original factory cable and I'm just going to measure between this point and the center of that rubber grommet and that'll be where the penetration for the firewall is. So we'll get that organized now. going to be the hole for the main battery penetration, that main battery cable penetration. This is the main battery cable being installed. I'm using the original BMW uh, cable that came with the car. It's going through the front there and that comes around to the electronic kill switch which is just in there which will be wired up to to a switch on the dashboard. <coughs> so the heater hoses that are going to go into the small little heater inside the car are going to go through here. I'm going to do two holes here. I'm going to use these grommets for the heater hoses to go through which fit to this the hose. I've just got one sit on the hose there and I've given that a measure with the vernier and that's coming up to around about 34 mil and guess what, I don't have a 34mm hole saw, so I guess it's down to Bunnings to get myself one. Looks like we've already got a, there's a 33mm hole saw, and then there's a 35 which is cheaper. So I suppose, neither is 34 I'll take, I'll take them both and uh, do a test hole and we'll see which grommet fits. I could only get a 35 and a 33mm hole saw so I'm going to try the 35 uh, and do a test bore. Wow, that's really no good at all. Jeez, is that only 35? Guess we'll try the 33mm hole saw. These are the 35 cut a 36mm hole. How good is that?
Well, that's the 33 hole. That looks like it's going to do the job. Holes need to go here and here, so I'll mark these out and have a look. It's going to look best. It's probably the best location. There we have it. Get some hoses through there now. And there we have the two hoses coming through the hole with the grommets in them now. In them now and the firewall side. Almost looks like they should be there. This is the electronic heater tap. I'm going to use and uh, it has a direction of that way go into there like that that'll be mounted about there like so this wiring comes up and it has just a on off to open and shut the heater tap so there'll be on the dashboard there'll be that and there'll be a, a single switch to turn the fan for the heater on and off. Well that's it for part 12. Hit the like button and subscribe if you're enjoying it all so far. The car is going to be getting uh, moving along a lot faster and we're looking forward really to getting it the Motec wide and the engine running. Anyway, talk to you next time.